I'm kneeling at the banks of the Taya River, which is outside of Skagway, Alaska, in the part of town known as Daiya, which was the launch point for the people who came for the Klondike Gold Rush. Right nearby is the beginning of the path of, over Chilkoot Pass, which is a, uh, a way to get through the mountains out toward Whitehorse and to the Yukon River. I went over to this bridge that's over here, which is the very beginning of the Chilkoot Trail. I only took a few steps on it, but it was kind of cool to see where it was at and see that that was actually where the, the, uh, the gold miners of a hundred years ago were launching off on their, on their hike carrying literally one ton of gear. They had to carry one ton of supplies, obviously, over multiple trips over the pass to get it up to the Yukon River because the Canadian government required it because so many miners were out there dying because they showed up with insufficient equipment and food and supplies. Today is the 4th of July. 4th of July in Skagway, Alaska. So, so I went on over to the town and it's hopping with activity. They had the main downtown streets were blocked off for festivities, blocked off to cars that is, pedestrian traffic only. I thought it was busy yesterday. It is quite a bit busier today. Looks like one of those cruise ships, a new one came up. There was a big one there yesterday and another new one was here to take its place today. And the streets were just packed and there were some hot dog eating contests. There was also some egg throwing contest. I'm not quite sure I couldn't see. There's so many people there crowded around. But I was unable to see exactly what was happening. I think they were tossing the egg, trying to catch it without breaking it. Anyway, that's all good and fun. Um, I uh, tried to get some ice cream and I stood in line for a half an hour to get an ice cream. It was, it was a good ice cream, but 30 minutes is a while to wait, but that's okay. That's the way these things are. I am a tourist just like everybody else, so I've got nothing to complain about. But I gotta say, right here where I'm at, this is what I call the right place to be for 4th of July. On the side of this nice river, it's nice and quiet. I don't know if anybody's in this campground right now. The evening is coming. I've already had my excitement in town for the day and I've already picked up my ferry tickets. So tomorrow morning, I will be heading off on the ferry saying goodbye to Skagway.